Hello, welcome to the BFI. Um, this morning we're going to make some healthy living smoothies with Gloria Brown. Hello everyone, we're here to make smoothies. And we have some fruit here. We have strawberries, we have kiwi fruit, we have bananas. Bananas are particularly good for potassium and they are very essential, especially if you're going to hospital to have an operation like I was. And I, didn't I didn't know that I had to eat bananas in order to have the potassium. So here we go, without any further ado, we will get some kiwi fruit and we will peel it. We so just cut, cut the fruit directly into the liquidizer um, here. And um, I think a banana is very good here. Um, I like my bananas a bit riper, but this banana doesn't look too bad. And we just take the fruit, the skin off, peel it. In fact, so there was a story where people didn't know what a banana was and they had it with the skin on years ago. So we just literally slice the banana. And I don't like to put too much fruit in. I don't like to complicate things, but I think the strawberries might help as well because it's got a little bit of fibre there. Not fibre is, makes you go to another toilet. <laughs> and that's very important because a lot of people in England, they suffer with bowel cancer. So I'm going to use some fibre here. And then I get the orange juice here. There's an, any juice will do, but the orange juice. And this is a particularly good brand, Rio del Doro. And you pour it into the container. And so, if we need more, we can always add more, but let's just try it out. Um, and I like plain yogurt. This has actually got a mixture of passion fruit and stuff like that. So I will use that, but generally I would use a plain yogurt because it's actually less calories. And I'm a big girl, so I'm always conscious of adding unnecessary calories. Just a little bit there. I would also put, we don't have it today, but I would put a little bit of oatmeal in there, which would give it a nice sort of bulk. But here we go. We will press the blender for a few seconds. We can make it faster as well. It. And this is actually the fruit smoothie, the test now. I always like to just give it a little bit of a shake, take the lid off, and we pour it into a cup. And I always say it's very important to taste it first before you ask other people to taste this. So I'm going to taste it. I'm no <laughs> coward. Delightful. Would anyone like some? Come on all. Here we go. Marvellous. And what, what's your verdict? My verdict is... Smooth. It's <laughs> very smooth. That's nice. There you go. Smoothie for you. And very cheap to make. Thank you very much. <laughs>